What is Combo Survey? Combo Survey is a surveying technique used to measure the survey lines by determining the angles using a compass and the linear measurements by using a chain. What is the principle of Combo Survey? The principle of Combo Survey is traversing. Traversing is the method of locating a series of survey line in the form of a network by placing survey stations one after another. The previously surveyed station is used as the base to measure the next point. The traverse can either be an open traverse or a closed traverse. What compass is used for compass surveying? The two main types of compass that are used for compass surveying are the prismatic compass and surveyor's compass. How to notate bearings in compass surveying? The bearings can be represented by two designations. Number 1. Whole Circle Bearing System WCB or Asimuthal System and Quadrantal Bearing System QB or Reduced Bearing Whole Circle Bearing System WCB or Asimuthal System is a system in which the bearings are measured from North Magnetic Meridian only. It is measured in clockwise direction. WCB of any line lies between 0 to 360 degrees. It is implemented in the prismatic compass. Quadrantal bearing system QB or reduced bearing system. In QB system, the bearings can be measured either from north or south, whichever is near. The measured clockwise or anti clockwise direction. The bearings obtained lies between 0 and 90 degrees. It is implemented in surveyor's compass. For example, in the figure 1, theta 1 is the WCB or the bearing for the line OA and theta 2 is the bearing for the line OB. This means the angles theta 1 and theta 2 are measured from the north magnetic meridian only in the WCB system. In the case of QB system, the line OA has the bearing theta 1 that is measured from the north meridian and it is represented by n theta 1 e because OA is lying in the first quadrant. Now when you consider the line OB, it is lying in the third quadrant that is the quadrant of south and west. So the bearing of the line OB is S theta 2 W. Here the bearing is measured from the nearest meridian south. You can read the article in our website and the link is given in the description below. If you like this video, let us know by liking, sharing and subscribing to our channel Engineering Fanatics.